Jeremy Fang, a Topeka firefighter, is miraculously going back to work after suffering a severe brain injury over a year ago. I got to hear from Steve Chapek and his wife Renee and those who made his rehabilitation process easy. In March of last year, Steve Chapek was knocked unconscious while practicing for a charity boxing match. I don't remember anything from that day. Chapek suffered a brain bleed, seizures, several infections, and a collapsed lung. So he would barely acknowledge um, that you know other people were in the room. He would barely acknowledge you know when people were. Um, trying to get him to move or ask him to do things. With doctors holding little hope he would survive, Chapek was sent to Madonna Rehabilitation Hospitals in Lincoln, Nebraska, where he made significant improvements in just five months. The days in therapy were like new stuff to do, um, things that I've never done before. Walking was probably the most difficult thing I ever done, have done because my right leg wouldn't work like back last year wouldn't work at all. He basically had to relearn how to do everything um, from speaking, walking, talking. The people at Madonna really helped helped to physically take care of him, but the, to teach me how to help take care of him. Steve made incredible progress um, fairly quickly when he was here with us, and so that shows prognosis is pretty good. It, takes a lot more effort to do those things that he used to be able to do without thinking about them. But as he continues to improve and his brain heals, um, things just get easier. And through it all, he managed to always keep a positive attitude. Truly really that joy that he brought to every therapy session was made it fun for everyone around, other patients, other families, other therapists. He just was such a joy to work with. In March, Chapek returned to light duty work at his beloved firehouse. The Topeka Fire Department is like the, probably the greatest place anybody can work. They are really taking good care of me and doing the best they, they thing they can do. To be able to go back to work, that's the amazing part. Um, we see people that survive that um, quite frequently, but those people are they're people that need supervision at home. They're not aware of their safety. For him to be back at work now, um, that's the miracle. So amazing to hear his story. Chapek continues outpatient therapy. He says he is most excited to get his speech and memory and movement in his right leg back. The